Hey guys, what's up? Uh, Muffin Sports Cards back again here with another video. It's been a while, uh, and as you guys can tell, my hat's gotten a little bit more crooked. It's like curving off one end a little bit. Uh, it's been a while since I've made a video really for you guys. I've had a lot of people asking me to make a video, just kind of give uh, probably a recap or something like that. I've been very busy. College has been starting. Uh, we're about a month into it, I think. Uh, so my first semester of college. Uh, and it's going really well, going really well. My classes are going well. I'm in a really easy math class. Uh, my only math class I have to take. My mass comm class that I'm taking right now, the mass media, media literacy class is pretty easy. Uh, we've got some projects we're working on and i got a couple other things that are going on. Uh, but it's been a blast. I'm working a lot as well. So just, I'm sorry about videos. Uh, some, some packages are gonna be uh, delayed a little bit. I've touched base with people that I've made trades with uh, and I've told them like the whole uh, scheduling that I can do for my packages and we're just gonna try to see how it goes uh, I mean I can I can ship usually once a week uh, but sometimes my schedule like I just kinda have to like work work through it and we'll kinda see just how it goes in the future there are some days that uh, I'd have to go all the way to town just to ship a package and honestly there are days that I don't want to do that and uh, so I apologize for some shipping delays but uh, I did make it up to a couple of you guys uh, and sent some extra stuff and I told you that I would so anyways uh, without further ado I just got a few little recap things for you guys of what I've kind of been getting since uh, I don't think I've added anything let me check I don't think I've added anything big well, I've added I've added nice things, but I don't think I've added anything into this. Have I? I don't think so. So uh, I'm just gonna go on with the video. I feel like I'm missing a card or ten. Hold on one second. I've been getting a lot of Nile Davis base from 2015, of course. I uh, did a box break, got him for like five bucks, I think, shipped or something, and got quite a few base actually. Uh, all right, I don't think I'm missing anything, so we're just gonna go with what I have already set here. And this is stuff that I'm just kind of estimating I've gotten. I don't think I've shown any of this to you guys, so. Uh, I've gotten like a few baseballs, I think. I don't think I've shown you guys this. Uh, Le'Veon, I don't think you can see it really. Is that a light? It's a Le'Veon Anderson, or Hernandez, Le'Veon Hernandez, uh, with inscribed MVP of 1997 or 70, I think it's 97 World Series. That's cool, I've got a bunch of baseballs set. Uh, over there, kind of been working on working on setting up for future projects. All right, so uh, some of the things I've kind of been getting, I got these in as care packages. Uh, one's out of 58, the Charles's, and this is pretty low numbered, I believe, out of 26. So some small stuff, uh, break items that I've been getting, uh, some clarities of Tomahali. And a bunch of base stuff. I think I have more than this, but the Smiths out of 99. I think I have more than this stuff, but I've, I've gotten quite a few Clear Vision just because I love the product. But I think I'm done with breaks for it for now, as far as I'm concerned. Uh, I got a Bo Wallace. I got this for 27 cents on eBay. That's not a bad thing. Out of 2015. Uh, it's right there on the bottom. Out of 2015. I got a really cool quad. Patch. Reason I got it, Tony Gonzalez on the bottom there, and that's Pro Bowl Relics. Really awesome. Love the card. Love it a lot, actually. Uh, Dwayne Brown Auto. Well, let's go this first. Out of 2015, this the Chiefs uh, team card. Really cool. Dwayne Brown. Uh, he got cut from the team, but he's on the practice squad now. Uh, my boy Andrew. He collects him, and I had to pick myself up an auto as well. One of the X Factor. Uh, variations and I actually just got a Conley just like it so I think I have all the three big Chiefs rookies uh, I don't know if Bo Wallace is in the set 
But if he is, I'll pick one up of him. But I think I have all the draft picks, uh, X Factors. Got a cool Marcus Peters red from Clear Vision. So now I have two of the reds. Got a nice Lynn Dawson auto on card. Got it for a good price, and it's a little X Factor. Really cool. Another. I, oh, I do have another Contenders that I got, but it's not a variation. I don't think it might be. I forget. This one's out of 99, though. Just got it tonight. Um, getting with the big boys. I got this. Graded 9.5. This is a super short print out of 25. And I actually have the other. It's a Population 2 graded. And I have both of them. Really cool cards. So I have both of the graded 9.5s and they're super short printed overall out of 25. So that's cool. Uh, cool. I have five of these 10 uh, flashy flawless cards. It's out of 10. And I have five of those. So that's cool. Got these. Two of the printing plates for the 2015 rainbow I'm not gonna miss out, hopefully, on some of the plates. I got a really cool DeAnthony Thomason. I uh, love the patch on that. It's just a beautiful card. Rainbow foil really works nicely with the card. My phone's going haywire. I apologize for that. Yeah, it's still going haywire. Uh, Hank Strom out of 27. Really beautiful card. My first cut, uh, first cut auto. Numbering's there somewhere. It's like right there. And so 27. I finally, uh, a long time ago, I'm going to make this a short story, really short. Uh, I, I did a trade with Saints Fan Always on YouTube, and I sent some flawless stuff to him, and I got cards like this. Uh, AFC logo patch and uh, the other the other one just like it, the swoosh, and a, a bunch of other things. Um, and then he ended up selling... A lot of his stuff, and I had given away a really nice, uh, flawless, my RPA that I had, which was at the time, like, probably my fourth best card, I think, or something like that, back when I collected him, and I missed out on his auction when he was selling it of the card, and I woke up, I think it was, like, this last week, and it got listed on eBay for really cheap, really cheap, and I picked it up, and it's back in my collection at a, tw or at a 15, uh, Nile Davis RPA. I love this card when I got it. I still love it right now. This is like, I just love it so much. I'm not going to let it go down. Uh, let's go with this one first from Jared Lauber. Really awesome guy. Chris Conley, one of one. I actually forgot to show my other stuff. So these are what I've been getting at Chris Conley lately. I meant to show these first. I apologize. Uh, Chris Conley, Variation Auto. Uh, Nice little certified, I think that's certified, RPA. Cool little patch auto there out of 125. Nice out of 75 or 150, or oh, this is out of 25, my bad. And then the silver ink. And I got the gold ink out of 10, flight 17. And then today, this shows up at my doorstep. Black one of one. Chris Conley, beautiful card, love it. I magged it myself. And the last card I got is not pretty, not bad. One of one, Nile Davis. I still haven't gotten my Marcus Peters one of one printing play in, which would be my sixth one. Oh, I did. Uh, I don't know where it would be. Oh, it's right here. I did get this. Crack dice, Marcus Peters, and I have these as well. Pretty cool. The other one, I don't know if it's a variation, but I have another, the black plate incoming of this. I don't know if it's this variation. I hope so, because that means I'd have three. And speaking of threes, I have two of these, but I just recently got this one. So I have three of the Marcus Peters uh, leaf one of ones. Juan Day Ones. So, uh, that kind of wraps it up, guys. I'm going to keep it about 10 minutes. I'm really apologizing. Like, I really do apologize for not making so many videos. I know if you're subscribed to me, you're looking for content. 
uh, for some content out there of my videos, but I've just been so busy uh, with work and everything, and it's just been really stressful. Um, I mean, not really stressful, actually. That's kind of a lie, because I do have a lot of downtime, um, and I do have a lot of time just kind of to myself to relax. But at the same time, like, after days of going to school and days of working, which are Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, uh, well, no, not Thursday, and, and Friday, Thursday, I'm off most of the time. Uh, like, those days, I really don't want to do anything in the p.m. and just post my mail, play Xbox, uh, and relax and just kind of enjoy it. So I do apologize, like, Thursday and Saturday usually, but I can get mail out Tuesday before I go to work uh, or Wednesday sometimes. So that's how it's going to be for a while, uh, but I'm going to be really trying to get myself in that schedule and getting in the habit of uh, when I can ship and when not and let you guys know. So I do appreciate that. I appreciate you guys watching my video, looking at my collection grow some more. we got a big stack coming in uh, still of things that haven't even come in yet, so I'll probably be making another video of that stuff when I can. So I appreciate you guys watching, uh, and you guys have a great evening, and I appreciate you guys. Thank you.